It's happening this morning. Starbucks workers are gathering outside the company's headquarters in Seattle, protesting what's called Investor Day. It's a planned meeting for executives and investors to talk about ways to expand Starbucks. Workers say their voices aren't usually included, and they are fed up with the anti-union campaign. King Fox Farah Jadrin is live outside of Starbucks headquarters this morning with more on the protest. Uh, Farah, good morning. Good morning, Mimi and Jake. Yeah, well, so it's not just Starbucks workers that are out here, but uh, other members of other unions and also community supporters are out here as employees are demanding an invitation to Investor Day. They say as employees, they're investors too, and they also say they're tired of what they're viewing as anti-union uh, measures from the company. I'm going to give you a closer look. It's a long line, more than 100 people showing up uh, in just the last little bit. Uh, in terms of those anti-union measures, it was just yesterday Starbucks announced new benefits for all non-union employees, including student loan repayment tools and a savings account program. On strike today, while the picket line is happening here at the Seattle uh, Starbucks headquarters, is the Seattle store at Broadway and Denny. Starbucks Workers United say they have formed more new unions in a 12-month time frame than any U.S. company in two decades. Workers say they want the choice to unionize without company retaliation and to negotiate a fair contract contract after doing so. So as for today's investor day, workers say that no a retail uh, employee of Starbucks has ever been invited to be a part of an investor day meeting and they say because of that they're not involved with any strategy planning or policy writing. Live in Seattle, Farah Jadrin, King 5 News. Thank you, Farah.